Hello, everybody. I'm Jane Tension. I'm family of Ranger Shell 7. Now I want to play titled Blitz Arena Warm Up on Chess Orc. Let's go. Okay, how can you hear me? Hello, everybody. Great. All right. Let's go here. Let's join. And let's type hello, all. Good luck, all. All right. Meanwhile, let's start with some coordinates. Right, oh, the same score is white and <laughs> okay, cool. Sixty one. Let's try one more. Right, 62. Well, let's go here. I guess turnout will start soon. So yeah, um, let's be ready. All right. Okay. Fifteen seconds till the beginning. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one, and let's go. All right, and play in the response to Mihaila Fetchislav. All right. E6. I know, I guess it's not the best move here I can play, but okay. This. That. Bishop G4. All right. Uh, I'll go for Rook E8. If Knight D5 then takes, takes, takes Knight D5 then F Knight up for the idea. All right. This. I S G5. I see. Ah, but he goes for Knight B5. Uh huh. Yes, I'll go for this Knight D6 and Rook to E7 seems. Pretty nice, even though he gets a pawn here. For now, I don't mind much. <laughs> For now. Uh huh, this, that. Um, a rookie four seems okay. Oh, someone got a win already, nice. Uh, h6, I guess I can, t I'm fine with trading. Queen d5, rookie two. Takes, takes. Okay. So, okay, um, in my ICS it's a bit worse pawn structure, so I'm gonna try to get use of it. Yep. Uh-huh. And I G4 is, okay, rook D4, uh, rook C4. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. That's a sneaky move though. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Interesting. Let's play Queen D six. B4, it's interesting, right, okay, um, rook here seems interesting, he takes, I'm gonna take with rook, 
Yeah, I mean I could take I could not take knight a2 because there he has rook c4 and queen d6. So yeah, that uh, takes a3. Mm -hmm. um, right, knight c2 and then my pawn can fall. Rook d4. Mm, let's try it. Is this a rook g4? But then he has queen e8. Gotcha. Let's go back now. We need to have queen f8. Yep. Okay. Mm. Well, <laughs> this position is pretty interesting. Ah, uh, yeah, queen of eight, I think, is needed. Wasn't really needed, but... Okay. Ah, uh, this. Queen b7. Right here, queen a6. Haha, -ha, knight c4. Alright. Alright, yeah, so I'm gonna try to create some problems for him. Okay. I don't know. H five takes D two. King G seven. Okay, I'll play with less comments. Alright, and the little game that was me how I just love. I mean, okay, I wasn't really losing all game. That was pretty okay one, I think. Uh, I could play better for sure. Here, Queen E6, I need to play more aggressive and play against Guru Domino. Okay. Takes B6. A4. E5, E4, I mean, okay, Queen A7 is a bit weird, I think, uh, but I'm not sure, though, I mean, poof. seems pretty okay, though, so far. I mean, it looked weird from first look, but now it seems pretty okay. Knight A4, Knight B6 is the idea, alright, Bishop G5. Mm-hmm, Rook E1. Um, let's not trade bishops off, let's try to leave them on the board, and knight a c5, next move. Yep. Um, uh-huh. Queen d2. Uh, bishop e3. Knight d4. Alright, um, we need two. You have to take here. Alright. Knight d3 is maybe not what I really like there. Yeah, against my Halifage stuff, I was winning here. Bishop f2. <laughs> Whoa. 
Alright, so I guess I'm gonna do this. I mean, bishop c4 looked great, but okay. Already did that, so I cannot move back. Uh, 96 takes. Alright. Okay, and bishop d5, he has bishop e2. I might do this there, rook b8, bishop e4. Uh, wait, I can do that, and then bishop e6, this exchange will fall, I guess. Mm -hmm. Alright. Yeah, seems good for me. Uh-huh. Uh huh. Bishop f4, taking z knight, f3, uh, bishop d6, bishop c5 idea. Yep. Yeah, I guess I should win that. 99% sure. <laughs> yeah, takes. B6 in game. A6. Okay. A7. Ah, ah. Bishop D4. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, in H1. Uh, all right. Let's not rush. Let's play this. Uh huh. Try to get rooks off. Okay. Rook d3. B4. Aha, uh -huh. <laughs> still not that simple. Okay, king g1, king f2 idea. I'm thinking f4, rook e1. Changing my menu. Oh, yes, king d4 is this red. Aye, aye, aye. Oi, oi, oi. Okay, that. King e4, rook d1. To be careful though. <laughs> oof, oof, oof. These. <laughs> Yikes, I really need to be careful. Let's do this. Here. Rook c8. Um. G3. Hmm. <laughs> Oops. Uh Game to Guru Domino. Good game. All right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> A7. Let's say mistake and play against Faceless Man. Two thousand two hundred and nine. Okay. This. D5. That. Uh, this I might go for that, I think, and bishop d7 right here. Uh, bishop d6. Queen c7, bishop f4 idea. Uh, maybe it's a mistake, but I think it's a free pawn, and I guess I'll be in time with my knight, uh, queen away after he, if he will take. Yeah. All right. All right. Um, 
H5. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Seems pretty okay. H4, let's put this knight away, so I guess he'll play like knight e2, then queen e3, and yeah, queen e3 check, queen f2, f knight g4, okay, but he doesn't go for it, yeah, if this, that, he has to take, I take, and it's a fork, so it's not great for him, I think, right, this, I'll still do knight g4. If he takes, I will take, and it's a fork. So you better be careful. <laughs> you better be careful. All right. Whoa, that's actually interesting. I'll go for that knight f3 is the idea. And if he'll take here rook h3, it's mate. Queen e3, as I already mentioned before, knight e3, and it's a fork. <laughs> And boom, and only if I see some to some 209. Alright. Okay, good game. Legends Gian's are. Oi, oi. What were we playing? Ultra Bullet. Played lots of Ultra Bullet. Okay, whoa, aha. Uh -huh. That's a sneaky opening. Let's play E3. Can get the pawn back. I don't mind much. I played last game two years ago. Whoa, <laughs> that's a lot though. I mean, okay, h3 just so he doesn't have vg4. Um, and two pawns up. I mean, of course, I want more, of course. Uh, but still, it's pretty nice for move number 10. <laughs> yeah, pretty nice position for 10th move. Uh, bishop c3, knight g3. Just to try to make his pawn structure even worse. Because why even worse? He doesn't have great pawn structure at the moment. But if I'll take on g6, it'll be even worse. <laughs> Alright, takes. I guess I will take. Mm -hmm. Bishop f5. Okay. Alright, so if he plays like queen c7 or he moves queen away. Oh, he doesn't. Um, then I might do this. I can do that also, but I guess I want to trade queens off. And I'll have a pawn up in some sort of end game. I mean, mm, what can I say? Not the best position because my knight will be not great there. Of course, I'll try to put it up. Ouch! Idea is skinny two, not to castle. He has rook d two, king e two, and yeah. Ooh, I had knight d six. Ooh, okay. Yeah, I had knight d six. It would be a fork and an exchange up. All right, then let's do long realization part. I think <laughs> if I don't have another chance to fork him. Okay, knight d six, rook c seven. Yep. Ah, uh -huh, so his idea is maybe that. Yes, I'll go g4 just so I prevent f5. Uh huh, this. Rook d5, rook hd1 idea. Uh, what is here? f8, f7 to be honest. I guess I'll go for this. And then yes, rook c8 and rook b6 is the idea. Right. Oh, he goes for that, but then rook b6 I can take there, so I guess I'll go for rook hd1, uh, a6, then I think I'll go for knight d4, we, I guess doesn't matter what I'll take with this rook, just to let him his rook away, because this pawn will fall, will fall, um, now let's play like, I don't know, king d1, I don't know, rook f6 this, uh, just make this to see how will he play. Now let's come back. Yeah, definitely. If I played knight d6, it would be a much easier win. For sure. Ooh, knight can be like a4 and then rook d5 try to get this pawn. Or I'll go for rook d5 immediately. Alright. 
Rook e5, aha. This is this. King f8, b3. That. Let's maybe do a4, rook d4. C4. Maybe c4 is a weird move, I know. I guess not maybe. I'm 99% sure it is. <laughs> Still 1% sure. 1% is it's not weird. Right, I'm playing for I played four games in 20 minutes. So we played almost 10 games. Whoa, well, maybe not 10, but seven. And it's I didn't finish my fourth one yet. Oh wow. Oh wow, oh well. takes and rook d2 rook d5 i mean now it's actually interesting that i played c4 because his pawn will fall here i guess so it seems good yeah i guess so aha uh -huh. rook d1 b3 idea just don't want to let him get to my pawn grabber rank la 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 i mean what if i just start pushing this rook b4, I guess. Uh, I guess so, right. But then I have rook d6. Check. Then, and what now? Rook d2, rook b5, can see one that's a draw. I don't like this much. Okay, and I wonder if giants are. Okay, <laughs> yes, it was a weird game, but at the end I somehow managed to win. Okay, phew. All right. Playing against Mehmet KCC. Right, 21 minutes for four games, yay! <laughs> nice, that's so cool. All right, C4, I guess most of these guys berserk usually. Um, yes, 32 points. <laughs> I barely got a hate. I got three wins and two of them I just was all losing or equal at the end. <laughs> so yeah, uh, well, <laughs> oh well, oh well. This, and then we need four trying to get here, and if knight c6. Uh-huh, I can go for that. He will take, I think, knight d5, and then... Knight d4, I take in the knight. If knight e7, I have knight c6 and three attacks, not two. Yeah, I guess if I played knight d2, he would be able to play knight d7 and protect. But here, I don't think that he will. Right, yeah, seems like I'll get a piece. Not only a piece, I think. Because now queen d5, and if he moves knight, queen a8, queen a8, bishop a8. Ah, okay, okay. I see. I'll just play rook ac1 so if you move this side and trade on c8 oh okay <laughs> doesn't even think much then bishop e4 bishop d3 just so it's no rook c2 rook c1 okay then bishop d3 king of one i think yeah, bishop d3, knight d3 takes d and king of one seems interesting. I need to put my king to attack, I guess. So yeah, king of one is, I think, my next idea. Planning, so at least. Uh -huh. 
Well, no, no, no. Here knight c4. I'm too, <laughs> I'm too greedy to not accept this pawn. Now knight b6. He should move knight and then rook c8 or or knight here. And Andre Mehmed kc. See, where am I? Yay, where am I? Hey, where am I? Yay, we're on 12. It's nice. Na 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 nice. Na 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 nice, nice, nice. 31 minutes left, so 25 minutes, 5 games. Okay, around 5 minutes for each game. <laughs> Play against Walter Player. And okay, it's 23 minutes. 3 and 5 doesn't work. Well, this is weird, especially a3, but after he played e3, I mean, it seems like still not what you have every day, right? But still, I mean, it's somewhat like hedgehog on the reverse colors. I mean, at least I call it like this. And it's pretty somewhat hard to break through. This hedge reversed hedgehog. <laughs> Just move my knight away, so at some point I might attack this pawn. Knight a5, then he has b4. Uh, I don't know though, it's hard. I mean, I guess I had a pretty nice position, but he has also quite okay position, which is really hard to break through. All right. Uh huh. What is his plan? I mean, I might. Whoops! I might play knight e7 just so he doesn't have knight f5 and knight g6, because I guess it won't be great. Great if he did. Uh huh. That's what he wants. I guess d4. I'm queen b5 d4. Okay, I'll go queen b5. Even if he goes d4, I'll take his queen. And if queen c7, I will think like rook c d8. Try to get his queen. <laughs> yeah. Ah, seems like queen c7, this, queen d6, rook c6, seems like queen is trapped there. And if he goes for this, this, that, that, queen a7, then this should be something, but I'm not sure what. All right. Uh, bishop takes, and if d4, I don't know. <laughs> right. Um, queen d7. I'll just go. No, I won't go back. This pawn will fall. Will fail. So I'll go for bishop f7. Even if he takes, his rook can get trapped. I mean, it's tougher to get the rooks than the queen, but still quite possible. I hope. Uh, first move. Let's go with this. So he should take. Then queen a6, and his rook will not get out. I guess. Aha. Uh -huh. That's interesting. That's actually an interesting one. Okay, queen a4, uh-huh, it's actually it's pretty okay position here. Uh, queen c6, so rook, rook a7 I guess is needed. And I'll do knight c4 I think. Yeah, maybe it's not great, but <laughs> I don't know, whatever. This. Hmm. Hmm. Open plays pretty nice though. So far. Or I play badly, or he plays nice. I guess it's <laughs> both. Type not play greatly, and he plays pretty good. Okay, this just so trap this and that. I guess he'll take on f8, I'll take rook f8 then. Now I guess I have to like knight b2 as the idea. Ah, knight e7, uh huh. Uh huh. I see. There's the key idea. Well, <laughs> um, with less comments. Ninety six, like ninety three, is the idea after rook a seven or rook b seven because my rook is protected.
take, he takes f takes c, or and if ah well, that's a bit weird. I mean, no, ah bishop f3, e4 then. Well, that's a bit weird, but okay, I like that. It's he doesn't play great, so I have something now. Takes. Three ninety six. No, we need no, no, no. We need then bishop h seven. That. Long time. Okay, that was hard one. Well, <laughs> Overton played greatly though, but okay. Then he played weirdly, and I get it. Whew. Bishop takes c4. Nice, I don't want any multiplayer. Let's get to an analysis. I mean, he played weird opening. But then he got pretty good position, and right here, yeah, he's an exchange up. Um, I mean, knight e3, white, uh, ouch! ouch, 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 ouch. Yeah, just play queen e4, he's winning, but he does that. Now f takes c, his rook hangs, so he had to go for this. And bishop e4, we we'll just play bishop d5, and yeah, that was weird one, okay. I played this one not great at all, <laughs> so to be honest, I, got, I was lucky that I escaped at least. <laughs> Alright, 6 games for 30 minutes, yeah, now it's truly, uh, truly, truly, <laughs> 5 minutes per game. <sighs> Legends Robin Hood 0 and 8. I was better here, yeah, when I was a pawn up, right, maybe Queen B3 was better, yeah. But then, then I was completely lost, and then he blundered, and I got the win. <laughs> I got the final, the uh, final advantage, and yeah, it was final till the end already. I guess it's nicer to say I got the advantage, and it was final. <laughs> it went. I mean, I was the final player who had the advantage. I'm confused. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh well. This takes if ninety five and bishop c three. C6 takes, and bishop e2, oh well. This, maybe that's a pawn blunder. I didn't want to count much. Okay, it goes for that, b3. This takes e4. I mean f4. Now nah, let's go bishop b4 because f4 is in queen c5. f4. Don't know if it's good, but f4. Okay. That bishop c4. Um. Well, now, 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 queen d3 is the idea. So if he moves knight and queen d8. Yeah, e5 is interesting. I mean, I wanted to make rook d3, but I guess it would be too slow. She already would move knight away. Yeah, um, huh? Uh huh. I play this, knight c5 takes, takes, takes. Queen f8, and I take, and I'm an exchange up, and my idea is bishop b6. Uh huh. He doesn't go, he doesn't fell for that. Well, um, bishop e3. Yeah, bishop b6 is too crazy to leave my bishop under fire already. It's also weird. Uh, hmm. Hmm, will I go for it? Okay, it seems interesting. Let's give it a try. Let's give it a try. Let's give it a try. 
All right. Aha, uh -huh, that's how he wants. Uh -huh. And how do I win here? So he sees, but then he has that. He can have two, maybe I'll play, I don't know. Yeah, this can have two. Through here, a five. Yeah. All right. And rook d3. It's also a pretty interesting idea later. That's actually interesting. G four. That's I know that's weird. <laughs> Let's see what will happen. Z's probably I don't think G three seems interesting that F takes G. Don't know. Maybe, maybe then king e2. Nah, king e2 now. King f2. Maybe king f2. Maybe, I don't know. <clears throat> don't know. Okay, what will he go for? He goes with this. I might play that. Knight g5 I'll take. And f6 can be interesting. Yeah. Okay, interesting. And I like that I'm up on time. It's also, I guess, cool. F6 is weird, I know. <laughs> Let's try. Ah, it's not only weird, it's bad, I guess. <laughs> But okay, it, it was all planned, it was all planned, guys. <laughs> Don't worry. It was everything planned. It is going all planned. Okay. I won the game Robin Hood 0 and 8. Well, good game. <laughs> yeah, I mean, okay, I need to go for bishop c5. But okay, it was all planned. It was all planned. It was everything planned. 7 on. Uh huh. On 37. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's see. On 36. Um, okay, that's a lot. Yeah, I didn't play much games. Usually I play like 10, 11, maximum 12. Let's see if I can reach that. Play against computer game lover. Oh uh, well, good luck. Yeah. Ah, here I was winning though. No? Ah, I have 7 and these just bishop h6. Cool. And king g7 is the same. Bishop h6 and queen f7 is the same. Oh, not the same, but rook f7. Well, <laughs> right, queen v6. Um, That seems not great for him, I guess. E4. I mean, maybe he plays it every game as black on d4, and maybe he's already sure that it's all good. But my first, I guess first, maybe I did before, but I don't remember at least. My first look at the position from black seems really passive. So I'm not planning anytime soon at least to play this. I won't say that I will never play this because maybe at some point I just will have a huge style change and then I think, oh, I mean, that's so beautiful opening. But at the moment, I don't think so at all. I mean, I like that open and displaying it. I feel that I'm better here. I'm not sure if I am, but it feels like it. And in my eyes, it's always nice to play when you feel that you're better. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Alright, knight f6, and if king h8, 
I might go for queen b7. I know it's weird on knight e5 and try to attack. Knight e5 is interesting move, but I'm not sure if I'll go for it. Okay, yeah, let's go. Uh, bishop c8. Or no, or bishop e8. I mean, all does all of those two doesn't seem great. Uh, okay, he goes for these. Oof. I mean, oof, why do I say oof? Should be happy with this, should I? I, I guess. I think I need to be. Queen h3. Yeah, why do I say oof? He, he, he chose to play this opening, so. <laughs> yeah. Um. Alright. h5 is only move, I guess? Only good move. Oh, he goes for these. Whoa, that's weird. Really weird. Now knight g4, h5. I mean, queen h4, knight f5, and just bishop d8. I guess a piece should be enough. At least for now. Then I am planning to get more. Yeah, knight f5, I'll be happy to take. Yeah, because I could go for queen h6, but then knight f5. And I need to go for this. Takes bishop d8, and I'm only an exchange up. But okay, <laughs> piece up seems better. Right, 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 right. Yeah, good game. And bishop e7 is unstoppable, and rook is trapped, so it's not good for him, I think. Ah, wait. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> now I have queen h6, and then knight f5, it's a rook, so it's even better. <laughs> you do want to give away peace? Uh, then I'll take the rook, sure. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, rook here. Yeah, I should win that for sure. But <laughs> knowing me how I play today, um, that's <laughs> not shaky it easy. Um, only 14 minutes left in tourney. Oh, 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 oh. time flies so fast though. <laughs> I didn't play, I played, that's my eighth game. Oh, right. Usually I played more, if I remember right. Alright, knight rate, no. This bishop c3. 94, yeah, that's, that's a win. These f3, yeah, so he doesn't play e4. Uh, okay, rook c1, let's double up the rook d6. Should be a win. Uh, g takes h, rook g7, king f2. Uh, these, I, I mean, okay, rook d7 is possible. I guess I'll go for it. Maybe it's not needed. And then f4 just to make his constructor better. e4, bishop f6. Right, that should be a win. But opponents use this main rule never give up, and that's actually nice. Um, Alright, h5, uh, king f5, and I'll take this pawn, z pawn. So that is 49 points already. Right. It's 14 minutes to go. Well, oh well, oh well. King e6 just so he don't run. Boom, and what game computer game lower, so let's quickly check one month ago game against him. Ah, aha, uh -huh, okay. Why doesn't he make a move? Okay, he did it, good game. Ah, uh, ta dun. Never mind, never mind. 49, cool. And then one month ago, I remember where I barely won in the same tournament. Right? Yep. Play against Genophon? He berserks, so yo yo. They want to analyze this game against computer game lower. Ah, okay. Someone analyzed it already. I played pretty well. <laughs> I guess better than all previous games altogether. Right, I'm back in shape. I, I hope. <laughs> I hope so. One second later. Uh oh. <laughs> nah. Okay. Um. So yeah, open and berserked. And now he has twice time less than I than me. Ah, uh, yeah, but okay, if you have losing position time, doesn't matter. And I guess it's even worse when you are losing and you don't have, and you are lo lower on time, because when you are up on time, you at least can think, 
how can you make your position better. But okay, um, yes, pretty nice position, I'd say. E3 is my idea. G5 is a knight f3. These. Queen c2. And rook a d1. Okay, this pawn hangs, but if I took it, my knight would fall. All right, now he spent 30 seconds and he spent 45 seconds, so he just spent half of his time. So, yeah, he just, let's say he made like almost a double berserk. <laughs> because see, at the first move, he had already one with a half, yeah, twice half time. He made half time for him. And now also, ah, I could take on h7. Ah, uh -huh, well. Oh well, let's do the same. <laughs> ah, oh well, doesn't work this time. Oh. Bishop d3. Queen c3. Queen f6. Try to go inside his camp, and that seems interesting to see. Oh, uh, is he made inside? <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, He's, he doesn't want me to stay inside him. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, c5, bishop c4. Oh, his king is not greatly placed, so it's just open. Uh, but his queen, his queen protects his king <laughs> for so many times. But okay, bishop c4, queen b7 should be good. I like it. Um, right, I'll do this, and then queen e7, queen c4 will take, or queen f6, or queen e5 is made threat. Right, takes, then, uh, I should be careful with queen d2, so I guess I'll go for that on rook d7. This, and boom. And one dream, gen no fall. Where am I? Ooh, Knight c4, uh, 30, uh, 30, uh, 34 is nice. I want to say nice, and then I said knight c4. Um, yeah, a6 was blunder, and then here I just <laughs> got him in previous game. Here it was roller coaster. Yeah, I had queen a4. Okay, play against Joe the boss. Alright, my ninth, my tenth game. Okay, I'll play more than ten games today. Nice. <laughs> These 51 points, probably it will be hard to catch top one if I'll get open and until just call mate all of them. <laughs> this is possible, but yeah, I mean, it's possible, but it's not really realistic to, <laughs> to make it though. So yeah, uh, d6, all right, it should be seven. Um, <laughs> and e4 looks not nice. E5, I'll open him so he can sacrifice an exchange. Yeah, I don't know. 97 queen trade seems interesting. If he goes for queen g3, say no, I don't want it. Then I'll sink. Still at two is a half or two. Two minutes twenty seconds, so I have more than enough time to think. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. So will it go? Will it deny the queen trade? Oh no, that's interesting. Yeah, I guess e five was the interesting plan. But, yeah, he <laughs> don't really want him. Oh, he left the network? Oh, okay. Just left the game. But if something, I'll wait. No, I won't claim victory. I'll wait till his time runs out. Even though maybe I won't get top 10 in the tournament. Ah, he came back. Here we go. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want... To, because, I mean, he may have a disconnect and he's trying to reconnect back. And I would just claim win. Okay, but okay. <laughs> it didn't happen, so why am I still talking about it? I don't know. Um, maybe f6, but then f5 and knight d5. <laughs> Thinking about knight d4. Right. Knight d2, I guess he will deny. If he denied queen trade, I guess he'll deny this because if. Oh, okay. So he says you can take on b3, 
a allow you. Yeah, he just what I how my logic worked that he denied queen straight, so he somewhat wants to attack as I thought. And he would probably deny knight straight to leave more pieces to attack with. I'd say like that. Alright, I was I'm preventing this. But he has that, which he even didn't wait. Uh huh. Um, queen c5, uh oh. Uh oh. I guess g6 is my idea. Ooh, 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 ooh. I need to be careful. Alright, yeah, rook h4, I guess I'll go for g6. And luckily, after knight e4, I have bishop e4. Six that. Uh, okay, g6. I mean, h6 is worse. Those so these. f5 I could play, but then on the thumb, knight f6, rook e6, so probably no. Um, well, I'm up on time. <laughs> That's important. <coughs> Not really at the moment, but okay. Queen f2. And then if queen h6 and these, that is these. Oh, I'm actually gonna try it. Actually, bishop g2 is the idea. Maybe it's weird. I know. <laughs> I make a weird move sometimes. But okay, mate threat is here. Rook is hanging and bishop g2 is the threat. And at some point I can play rook f e8 and I have knight f8. So, we'll see. We'll see what will happen. At some point. Okay, it's this. Uh-huh. I see. So bishop g2, he probably won't take and play king h2. There, I don't know. <laughs> Not the position I dreamed of, but okay. Now let's maybe go rook f d8 so at some point I can attack his bishop. If something, if he moves rook e3, then queen g2. And yes, he's slow on time, so it will be nice. Yeah, knight f8. Uh, uh, luckily, I have knight f8. <laughs> what a spicy game today. today. Aha, he goes for that. We go queen c1. So you cannot take these. Hmm. <laughs> Here, you want to let him play knight e4. Oops. Well, to be honest, say he played much better, but at the end, I won't him Joe the boss. <laughs> yeah, so he deserves a win more, but okay, he was slow on time and <laughs> managed to get it. Oof, yeah. Okay, here I had a chance to make it equal f5. Wow, what a move. Play against Asta Master. Okay, so let's try to get a quick win. But I won't really rush if if I'll manage to win like I usually play on speed. It will be nice. If I don't, it's okay. <laughs> it's three minutes left. I mean, it's hard, of course possible but a little bit unrealistic i mean i still believe <laughs> that i can do it but it, it will be hard all right bishop e3 uh h3 just no g4 just so no g4 queen c2 a3 rook a d1 okay Knight d5, let's try to like deflect so his bishop won't look. I guess he will play like rook c8, but I'm not sure. And yeah, I don't know. Hmm. 
Knight eh, h2 is my move, just maybe f3, f4 ideas. Knight g4 is interesting. We need to knight g4 is also interesting. So yeah, seems like we g4 square. Okay, rook f1. I'm waiting that he'll take, but he doesn't. Aha, that was his plan to, to take my pawn over here. Aha, uh -huh, I see. I see what you plan. <laughs> but it was too late, I guess. Okay, yes, I should go for it. Even though maybe I'm not happy with the position. Uh, yeah, this, I'm pawn down. I'm gonna try to hold this. His pawn on c7 is weak, then a a4 pawn is weak at some point. Okay, and I'm actually gonna try like play bishop d2, knight e3, knight f5. Like this. Yeah. Maybe can g2 rook h1 to attack this pawn. Okay, that. Now this one is weak also. There has to be careful. Uh, this. Now I have four idea. <laughs> yeah. Position, even though I'm a pawn down, is extremely interesting. In my eyes, at least. Mm, maybe I'll just make a move. So he plays f5. If he will play it, at least. He doesn't. Knight c3. Mm-hmm. F5. Uh-huh. <laughs> now maybe F3. Now 6 and that, maybe. This. I don't know how does he want to break through, though. Rook H2. I mean, he can move knight away, but where? Probably g7 is in the square he wants to put it. Mm. Rook here, knight f6. King of two, king e2. Yeah, okay. Uh, rook f8, and he has that, so maybe I'll go for bishop d2 and end rook f8 is the idea, because knight is win and bishop g5 check, and my rook will fall there. So yeah, still a4 is a weakness, but I guess it's not the most important pawn in his pawn structure. I mean, h5 is a weakness also, and e4 is a weakness. So in my eyes, he has a lot of weaknesses. Uh, it's, to be honest, hard to get used of them all, uh, but I'm sure it's possible, like knight d4, knight c6, try to get a bishop. So yeah, um... I'll try ninety five. I'm probably gonna take uh -huh, this. Check then rook h eight. Ah oh, well, <laughs> wait a second. Rook f two is the sneakiest trap. But he actually falls for rook g four. I actually didn't see that. But okay, it seems like I'm gonna win this. I'll see. Won't take. It still won't take it easy. Rook e four has like rook f two. So you have to be careful, but I'm sure I'm 99% I'm 99 sure, percent sure that I'm winning because rook e6, rook h5 is really hard to stop and bishop f6. Ah, it's winning, nice. Even though this game didn't count, even though I wasn't winning all game, I was actually okay with forcing a draw rook c8, knight 3 rook 8 knight b5. But he wasn't good with it and I understood him because he was a pawn up. But yeah, at the end only one loss, so great tournament. Uh, even though maybe at higher place, uh, I'm sure I lost or drew more than one game here. Only one loss. And yeah, oh well, good game. And only Master, Master, Aster, Master. Right, Josie Boss, yeah, he was completely winning. Well, 40 seconds, I'm sure it's not the greatest. Just wanna check. Boom, boom, 30, what? 40, 40, okay. Here I had 32 points, 40 fifths. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Ah, okay, remember. All uh, right, so yeah. Uh, I, I, yeah, you see, I lost one more game. 
At the end, here I got 37, also 32 points, but I played 12 game. Here it's only 10 counted. So today I played much, let's say not much, but less games. Ah, oh, here he remembers he's talking in here. I could win. He <laughs> said I could draw, which didn't count. Oh, yeah, he remembers as well. And the 37, yeah, so what's better, Tornis? That's all, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. So here it was. I get thirty-two points. Wait, I, I didn't close this tourney. Right, thirty-two points, eleven games, two losses. Um. Then again, uh, here it was twenty-eight points. I got two draws, two draws. Then one and uh, three draws and one loss. And Twenty-eight and seventy-second. I finished. Then eighty search. Uh, two draws, one loss. And uh, then 58, 30 points, two draws and one loss, uh, uh, two, two losses and one draw. Yeah, against Aster Master he was better, but then e4 and he gave me the edge. His bishop was better on d8 and yeah. Well, pretty good tournament. Um, thank you all for the games. Congrats to fall Fallen, Fallen, yes, Fallen. Order Daniyar Medibayev and uh, to Parmulario. Okay, so performance 2630 against play 10, win rate 90, berserk rate because zero and average rate in 2229. The so first fallen order 57 points, second Daniyar Med Medibayev. 22 games, oh well. Then Parmulario, 49 points. Uh, search, uh, Force H1, Epotist, uh, 48 points. Uh, fifth, Fidmaster AH, Kashefi, 48 points. Uh, sixth, Indrachmaster Ice, 86, 46 points. Seventh, okay, he also uh, he played 11 games. <laughs> All right, then it's uh, Chess Famil, 200, with Sense plays 46 points. Um, then no more draw, 44 points and 8. Then 9, Dinosaur, 44 points. And 10, Size Lord VG, 43 points. Well, I'll show top 700. Here I am, hello! Uh, boom, boom. And it's only one game to analyze. <laughs> nice. Okay, just kidding. I usually have 2 plus. <laughs> Next. Next, next. So yeah, I mean, okay. In my eyes, I didn't play the, let's say, not the greatest tournament. Most of game, not most, but some of the games, I got extremely lucky. At some point, where I was just like um, losing or drawish, but I got a one on time or something like this. But okay. I lost one game where I was also somewhat okay, whole game, more or less okay, and then it's big, I made a time scramble, <laughs> made it in time trouble, I made a big blunder in time trouble, I made a big blunder, and I played 10 games, which counted, I guess it's the shortest game I ever played in this warm up, right, so that's all, that's first 700 of yeah, of all players. So, ah, yeah, I got 42nd out of 3,727 3, players. Nice. So, 11 games played, plus 9 rating, 10 wins, 1 loss. Uh, one game didn't count. If it would count uh, against Aster Master, I would be around. Yeah, it's actually, well, 23, 24, wait, 36. I would actually be 23rd. So it would be nice, <laughs> or maybe 22nd, but somewhere there. Yeah, 23rd. But again, I was slow playing it. All right, let's analyze lost game. Only lost game to Indrash Mas Mihailov, Vyacheslav, and Elfin stream. Five in extra mistake, four bonus, 54 average rating for him, and four in extra one mistake, seven bonus, 76 average rating for him, for me. So from the opening, I actually got pretty nice position. Here, Ricky Sam was able under to go for rookie six. Because now, if I played rook e6, knight b7, then I have like queen e7. I think only move, to which I'm better, knight c5 I take. 
they play d6, I play rook d6, and I'm better. And here he had knight to b7 instead of knight f5, which he played. And knight b7, rook b7, and here my knight falls. Yeah. Here, rook e4 blown, I had to go for queen d7, trying to win his pawn, and I'm actually better. Bishop f6, mistake, queen, bishop h4. Now, knight g4 blown, I have queen b1, and here a beautiful move, absolutely. Bishop f2, I had to go. If rook f2, then I sneaky queen g5. If rook c2 is a knight f6, and I'm losing, so it's queen g5. If he moves queen away, then rook c1, or this d takes c, I'm winning. Right, if he takes with knights and just knight rook c2, this, I should be winning after rook e8, I think. Yep, well, then, 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 then. Rook f, if king f2, then I have queen h4 or queen d4, and then rook c2, and if he goes king h1, then it's rook g4 works, but queen h4 is better. So I had to take the queen, and if he moves away, then rook g4. So cool, sneaky thing. Here he had to go for queen b3. I had to go for rook d4, and if, ah, queen e3 has this, and queen c3, it's knight a2 fork. So he had to go for queen a1, queen e1, this, and I'm better. Yeah, I didn't see that. Okay, oh well. And then it was equal for quite some time. Then right here, rook e5 was a blunder between queen e6. Here he had rook g1 with some discovered checks threats. So these, these. King e7, bishop c6, rook f1, he should be better. Bf3, mistake, bishop queen g3. And here he's better. Rook c5 was a blunder to go for queen e6. And it's equal. Then king e7 blunder to go for king f8. And queen e5, mistake, bishop queen g8. Had to give a queen. After rook g8, he should be winning. And yeah, but after this, here mate and dollars game in the Shumas Mihail of Yachislav. So it was rook e6, <coughs> queen e7. Then it was beautiful, this. Then rook d4, then what was it though? Queen e6, what was it now? Queen e6, king f8. For him, I actually don't remember. Okay, I remember this. And was it bishop h4? It was. Was it queen to d... Mm. It was? Nah, 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 queen, queen b1. Then... So queen d2, rook d4, I guess this would work. Queen b3, yeah. Then right here it was rook g1 with the scouts uh, check attack. Near rook g1 also? Nope. Uh, what was it then? Rook c1, queen g5, ah, queen g3 check. Okay. So on this cool note, I'll finish stream. I hope you liked it. If you did, please share, please share my team on Chess Bench Club and ITM. There are 866 members, including very, very much. So 134 members and like tournament, 1000 members. And we say we'll be very happy. And thank you for following our Chess and Don't Twitch and share Please about our ends of writing in this comment video and please share on Chess. And also please share this and please in the description. Yeah, bye bye. Come back. I'll see you soon. See you tomorrow. And I'll see you soon. I'll see you soon.